Hello and welcome to another one of D's ADD videos. Today we're going to look at part two of example one, calculating the rate law from experimental data. This is the actual calculation portion of the video. Initial rates. Okay. So this goes in there twice. And this also happens to go in there twice. So what is the exponent? Two equals one. So we found one of them now. Now to find the other one, we go back to our table and we ask ourselves, okay, I need y. Y is the second column exponent. So I go to where the first column is constant. Okay. So one more time, I'm looking for y. Y, if you remember, is the exponent of the second reactant. I died. So I have to look first to figure out where Y is or what Y is. So first reactant is constant here and here. They're both 0.08. So I, I do a ratio of the second two or the first two experiments, 0 0.034 over the 0 0.017. And you got it. Yep. Okay, so we're going to get 2 to the y equals 2. So y equals 1. So now we've almost got our rate law. Our rate law looks like this at this point. Understand the concept. I went through it slow and repeated it a couple times. That way you can clearly understand what's going on. All you got to do now is practice a few of them on your own, okay? And the key to all this stuff, whatever you're taking, is practice. The more you do, the easier it becomes, the less surprise there is, the less anxiety. I hope I've eliminated any doubts you might have. Thank you and have a nice day.